Hey, 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 what's up everybody? This is Tony with La Lita Loca, and today we're going to explore the question, how safe is cruising? So there have been a couple stories over the last few days of people going overboard on a cruise ship. These instances have people asking the question whether cruising is a safe vacation option or not. Yeah, a recent National Geographic article citing data compiled by Cruise Junkie Dot com reports that there are around 300 individuals who have gone overboard since the year 2000. There were 17 instances of people going overboard in 2017 and five instances so far in 2018. Comparing this to the almost 20 million people who cruise annually, we see that falling overboard is almost statistically impossible. But people do tragically go overboard and cruise ships are working on new designs to minimize the ability to fall off the ship. Measures such as higher railing and monitoring decks with security cameras have already been put in place. Additionally, the Coast Guard is working on technology that will rapidly alert ships when people fall overboard. There are other safety concerns when it comes to cruising. Issues such as exposure to viruses, theft, and assault are more frequent than falling overboard, but are still minimal compared to the amount of people that cruise each year. And the potential for cruising to be fatal is far less significant than even driving your car. The National Geographic article reports the odds of dying on a cruise ship are around 1 in 6.25 million, while the odds of dying while driving your car is about 1 in 645. Now I follow cruise news on almost a daily basis and there's nothing more tragic than hearing these stories of people going overboard. Whether it was intentional, whether it was an accident, it is the saddest of the sad stories. Most of these stories do not end well. If you go overboard on a cruise ship, uh, the odds of being rescued are very slim. And by nature, we tend to let those negative stories affect the way that we feel, uh, the way that we perceive things. This is true in cruising uh, when multiple stories come out of people going overboard there is a heightened concern about safety on cruise ships and while we should be mindful of safety concerns going overboard the other safety items mentioned earlier uh, we also have to remember that cruising is still one of the safest vacation options but what do you think how did the recent stories about folks overboard affect the way you feel about cruising are you more or less likely to cruise leave a comment below let's keep the conversation going and if you found this video helpful, uh, please uh, hit the like button so we can uh, know to keep making content like this. If you haven't yet, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and follow me on social media. All the information is listed in the description below. Uh, I am Tony from La Lida Loco. We appreciate you stopping by. And until the next time, I'll see you on the Lido.